One day, Deer met Snail at the edge of the river. Seeing the snail crawling slowly, the deer arrogantly said, Hey snail, do you dare to run with me? The invitation felt very mocking. The snail thought for a while, then replied, Okay, I accept your invitation. But don't be ashamed if you lose the race. Deer replied, No way. I'm going to be beaten by you, snail, the world's first class crawler, Deer Mott. All right. Let's set the day quickly, replied Deer. How about Sunday tomorrow, so that many people can watch, said Snail. Okay, I agree, replied Deer. While waiting for the appointed day, Snail organized a plan. She immediately gathered as many of her friends as possible. In the meeting, Snail encouraged her friends. The herd of snails, they were determined to win the game. The tactics of the snails were assigning each snail to be among the grass. Later, when snail's name is called, then the fellow snails who are in the front post must answer him. And so on. The long-awaited day of the running competition finally arrived. The animals who wanted to watch were present. They came from all corners of the forest and seemed excited. Some were cheering the deer on. Others shouted support for snail. The race leader invited the participants to enter the competition area. The deer, chin up, walked bravely to the starting line and stopped behind the line. Next, there was Snail calmly walking into the arena. Hmm, just to get to the starting line, it takes so long, said Deer to himself. Even though the distance is close, he mocked again. The race leader raised the flag, signaling the start of the race. The deer ran very fast. He released all his energy. The audience's applause echoed, encouraging the deer. After running for many kilometers, the deer stopped. While catching his breath, he looked back to see Snail. It turned out that he didn't see Snail. Whoa, how come I haven't seen Snail's nose? Whom? I seem to have left her far behind. He 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 he, whispered the deer proudly. But to make sure how far away he was from Snail, the deer called out to Snail. 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 Snail, where are you? The deer shouted in a mocking tone. For a moment, the deer didn't hear any answer. But ten seconds later. Yes, I'm here, exclaimed Snail from behind. Ha! Huh? The deer was shocked while turning his neck in the direction from which the voice came. He turned his body around and was very surprised to see the snail a thousand meters in front of him. Knowing the unfavorable situation, the deer exerted all his strength to run faster so that he could catch up with snail. Snail immediately pulled over into the grass which was on the side along the race road. After half an hour of running, the deer began to think that he must be far ahead of Snail. The deer stopped and caught his breath, then called out, Snail! 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 Where have you got to? Deer shouted. As before, Deer did not hear any reply from Snail. A few moments later, Deer was surprised again. Yes, I'm here, replied to Snail from a thousand meters in front of him. Over and over again, it was like that. Until the Deer was discouraged and exhausted, he could not run anymore. The Deer finally gave up and admitted his defeat. The spectators were all amazed. Finally, Snail won the match. 
She just smiled a little and did not show excessive happiness. The deer, however, did not feel humiliated by Snail's warm embrace and offered him a glass of cold water to drink.